If your brother is not breaking the law, why is your brother in jail? And if your brother broke the law, let us see the evidence. Let us see what the brother did. Or the sister did. You can't just be picking up people, law-abiding citizens, who are trying to let their voice be heard for a better Uganda. And I, I, I want you oppressors, you black oppressors need to understand something. So if you think shooting innocent people are going to stop these young people who want change, you better get ready to kill all of them. Because death is evident. And it has been demonstrated by our dear brother Bobby Wine. So Mr. President or Prime Minister, whatever they call these youth, the youths of today, they ain't afraid of your guns. They ain't afraid of your prisons and your torture chambers. It's time to let people exercise their God-given rights that you are enjoying. What, what make you more privileged to enjoy freedom and your brothers and sisters are being robbed of their freedom? What make you more, makes you more privileged? Is it that you were born with supernatural power? Can you fly? Can you go 200 days without food and water? Well, if you can't do none of these things, it simply means that you are no more than a human being than I am. So why is it that you must get all these privilege. How do you imprison freedom when you are privileged to be free? It's time, black people. It's time for us to let these people know that we are not taking any more oppression. Oppressive hands. over us.